Hello, I'm Kelly Kim, but you can just call me KK. Today, I'm here to describe my photos, which describe my life. Today, I'll have about five photos, and so let's go over those right now. The first photo is about a comic in Edison, and I always feel fun when I go to Edison because there are so many good friends, and I really like drawing comics. First, it's really simple. To draw one character, you can just draw a circle, a square, and four lines. And if you just put some little speech bubbles, it's just finish of the comic. And also, I think drawing comic can actually improve my creativity. This is the second photo. This is the picture I took in front of my house. And the last picture is really sunny and bright. I really love this picture because it's spring and there are flowers in the bushes. And also, the color green became bright and yellowish green instead of just green by the reflection of the sun. However, if it rains, it becomes like the right picture. And it really sucks because it's really dark and gloomy. Also, the rain just blew the old flowers away in here. If you see, there's no light or flowers. So I just prefer the last picture and I hope every day is like that. The third, it starts with a story when I went to a, when when I went to the Ogun Park in Children's Day this year. I went there with my brother and my mom, and when I walked through, I saw so many green trees because it was a forest. And when I walked and walked, there were so many trees. When I saw the color green, I felt very confident. And the air in the nature was very fresh. However, when I walked and walked, I was just so tired of the color green and I didn't want to see it anymore. And so I went to the place where flowers are here. It was very colorful with four colors, like purple, pink, and white, and yellow. And this actually helped me to get rid of the color green. I really had a good time in the open park in the children's day because it was better than only playing games and hurting my eyes in my home. The fourth photo is about my cute dog. When it was parents' day in this year, I went to art box. My mom bought it, but I didn't know why. But I was really satisfied. I was curious why she really bought it for me, but I was actually delighted because the small and blue tiny shark doll was here. It was so cute and adorable. And because I love dolls, this was a friend for me instead of a present. And the last, uh, it's really messy if you see, but if you think it's messy, then you're just normal. <laughs> and I really love dolls as Galapagos boss because first, when I'm alone, they become my friends and just cure my loneliness. And second, when I see all of them, I can recall all the good journeys because they are from all different places. Here, Guamzilla, Guamdula, Gumamon, Corvo, and Guamkrong is from Guam. And when I see them, I think of the swimming pool and the hotel and the beach of Guam. And Majayo is a doll and is from Pokemon, but he's from Haiwan. Haiwan is a very good place to go with your family. And here, Panda Nita is from Everland, and I was there with my best friend. And Kyupi, uh, if you see it, it's the only person shaped doll, and it's a little weird. But I got it from kindergarten. And who Alu and Huale is really small, but and Huala is three uh, there are three koalas. When I was in kindergarten, my friend went to Australia and bought it for a present. And the duck over here, I actually bought it with fake money. If you think it's a little bit so strange, I'll tell you because 
There was a bazaar in my school, and so I could buy one, make money. And the biggest bear here, if you're curious about it, uh, I don't really know where she's from, but it's really furry and adorable. It's the size of my body, and I always hug him when I sleep. So, of all of this, I love Godzilla and this bear is named Jamra, and I like Godzilla and Jamra the best. And so that was the end of my presentation. If you have some great photos too, please share with me and bye bye!